Hey everyone, in this video um, I thought it would be fun to share with you guys some of the Christmas gifts that we got. I've watched a couple of other YouTubers Christmas gifts and it's just fun to see what people got. And look, here's one I'm laying with now. The super soft blanket. Naked. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to point out, I know I've said this before, but Jared and I both have divorced parents and we still see each family for Christmas. So we have lots of people that buy us presents. We've got four different Christmases we go to, plus our own. We buy gifts for each other. So we got lots of stuff. I'm not showing every single little thing, but just some of our favorite stuff and some of the bigger stuff we got. So yeah, let me show you what we got. Okay, so here's one thing that we got from uh, my mom and it's one of our favorite presents. We had some bar stools before and we had them uh, ever since we moved into our house. So we've had them for about five years. And a few months ago, the seat on them broke. Um, you could still sit in it, but like it broke from the bottom. So it was really uncomfortable. And this is where I sit most of the day. It's where I do my meal planning. It's where I do YouTube videos. It's where we eat breakfast and lunch. So we really needed some new bar stools. My mom got these at Lowe's. I think they were like 50 or $60 each. And they swivel, they are adjustable. I was really sad about getting rid of our old ones because I really liked the other ones. Uh, the seat was always comfortable until it broke. But yeah, I'm really happy with these. They're really comfortable and I like them. So there's our new bar stools. And here's what my sister got me. It's a cast iron skillet. I can't even pick it up with one hand because it's so heavy. It's the Lodge brand. And uh, yeah, this is what I told her I wanted. I don't know a whole lot about cast iron skillets, but I mean, I've heard they are good and you can stick them in the oven, right? I think. So a lot of times I make recipes that uh, call for cooking on cast iron skillets and call for putting in the oven the skillet. And all I have are these little, those little bitty like fajita sized cast iron skillets. So I can't cook very much on those. So I'm really excited about using this. But I do need to, I feel like I need to research it a little bit because I don't know like how to season it and do all that stuff or how to take care of it. So that's another gift I got. And then one thing I asked Jared for was a toaster cover and I think it's pretty cute. I think he got it at Bed Bath & Beyond. Just have a black toaster under there and it's always dirty and dusty so I thought it would just look better with the cover over it. And I got, we got like three bags of Starbucks Christmas blend coffee. Those are always yummy. Here's our candy stash. We got a ton of Christmas candy, as you can tell. Jeez Louise. Anybody want some candy? And another thing that Jared got me was a new LipSense lip color. I don't know if you guys have heard about LipSense. It's kind of new. Um, they're really expensive to me as far as makeup goes because I don't spend much on makeup. But some of my friends from church started selling these uh, like in June. And then when I got some money for my birthday, I caved in and bought a couple colors. Uh, when you start out buying your first color you also have to buy a gloss to go over it and the color lasts all day and they're really pretty so that's what's so good about it is that it's the color stays on all day so the first one i ever bought was this first love color and then you have to buy the uh, gloss to go with it and then the remover for if you, oops remover if you make mistakes so the starter kit is 55 dollars, and then the colors are 25 dollars. so i bought these for my birthday this color is aussie rose and then I've been wanting a new color, so I want a sheer pink. So that's what Jared got me for Christmas. I've been waiting patiently, and I tried it on, and I wore it on Christmas, and it is so pretty. I'll post a picture of me wearing it. But yeah, they are expensive, but that's why I wait till special occasions to ask for them. So that was one gift I was really excited about. And then something else I've been wanting for a while is a mini colander and also a good pair of tongs. The only ones I have for cooking are these little bitty cheap ones. As you can see, they're really small. So I didn't realize I asked two different people for these two things. Our aunt got me this and then my mom got me these. And yeah, I'm not sure what to do about that, but there's something else I got. And then this is something I really wanted, I asked Jared for, because we get a lot of greens in our CSA. The collard greens, the mustard greens, and the kale, they're really time consuming having to uh, chop them up and stuff. So I found this and I've been really looking forward to trying it out. But of course now our CSA is over so we're not getting greens. But we'll have to try it again next season. This is what my grandma got me. is a new pair of shoes. I've been really needing a new pair of slip-on shoes like this. The last pair that I had, um, I think they were Vans. And I wore them literally for, I don't know, probably eight years or so and I actually still have them but they're just so worn out and I can't find a pair just like them so I ended up picking these out from Dillard's they are Tom's black 
and I really like them. They're comfortable, and I like the way they look. So thanks, Mima. This one was a total surprise and probably one of the best gifts that we got. My grandpa renewed our museum membership. Uh, Jojo loves going to the museum and she's actually been asking about it quite a bit lately. But I've been too cheap to go up there. Plus we have a zoo membership. So this expired in August and now we get to go again for the next year. Jared's dad and stepmom bought him a new fan for outside. So I wanted to show you guys our old ones and why we wanted a new one that's been there ever since we moved in um so yeah very small and crappy and i don't even know why we need outside fans but um i guess for when it's really hot so there's the old one and i'll show you the new one so here's the new one we got as you can see it's going to be a lot nicer i don't know when he'll get around to hanging it up but there it is and then also jared got some home depot gift cards he's been wanting to put some drop down lights in the kitchen like drop down lights or a chandelier. Just wanted to have some better light in this area. So we'll buy something at Home Depot with those gift cards. And then here's a few other gift cards and money we got. This was from my grandma. She, she who bought me the shoes. She also gave me 20 and then 20 for each of the girls. And then just a $25 Visa gift card. Some Amazon gift cards. A Victoria's Secret. Uh, my mom got me this one to one of our favorite Mexican restaurants. So I'm thinking we might use that on New Year's Eve to go out to eat. And then Starbucks, $10. And then another gift card to one of our favorite little Thai restaurants. And here's something that my Mimi got me. She knows how much I love Disney movies and The Little Mermaid. And I'm just so in love with this ornament. Especially because it's glittery. And it's just so pretty. I love it. Here's a few other things we got. My mom got me this little foot set from Mary Kay. I have really bad cracked feet on the bottom of my feet. So I'm hoping that this works out good and of course I don't get go get pedicures much because I'm too cheap so I'm sure that's why she got me this a foot soak and a foot balm and then these handy dandy little things and then I just got a little peel off mask got a little bit of jewelry this pretty bracelet it says family and then I know a lot of people on my other videos they say how much they like a necklace that I always wear that has a J on it so I got this new little J necklace from my dad and stepmom so I really like that. And then Jared got this cologne from my Mima. She works for Dillard's. So she gets a big discount. So we went shopping one day and she got that. And then I always tell y'all how much Jared likes taking baths. Bubble baths and bath salts and stuff. So so he got a few bath bombs. Bath, whatever you call these. Bath bombs. I've never used one. But he's already used a couple. So he got that one. And then he got some candy cane ones from my sister. My stepmom started making some homemade soaps. So these look really pretty and they smell good. So that's what she made us. Here is what Jared's mom got me. Uh, we leave our door that goes out to the garage right there open all the time and so bugs can get in and I can't stand it. Uh, but we like to leave it open just because when we're hanging out outside and Jared's sister has one of these so I figured this would be good to put right there. Yeah, it's just a screen to keep bugs out and stuff and it's just it's magnetic so it's really easy to walk through so I can't wait to put that up and use that I got two cookbooks for Christmas this one is from Jared's aunt she watches my YouTube videos so she knows how much I like cooking and like doing the meatless meals so she always gets me little cookbooks and then this one that's not how much he paid for it Jared got me this online I think it was used but it looks great condition um, so I rented this book from the library a few months ago and I kept it for as long as I could. I think I renewed it like three or four times. And then when it came time to take it back, like I was acting real sad and I was like snapping pictures of some of the recipes and Jared was with me. So uh, he ended up getting it for me and I've uh, made a few recipes from there and they turned out good. So that's why uh, I didn't want to give it up. They're like healthy, but easy. Yeah, anyways, so I really like that one and I'm looking forward to trying some more of the recipes. And then my mom and I are both big wine drinkers. So she got me this bottle of red wine, and then she got us a couple of glasses with J's on them. Jared doesn't really drink wine like I do, but she bought one for both of us. And then this little topper, Jared's aunt and uncle got me, and so I really like it. It opens, and you can pour and then close it. So it's always good to get the bottle of wine. Also, like I said, Jared's aunt watches my cooking videos, so when she sees that I don't have like matching bowls and stuff 
she wanted to get me these so she's really thoughtful so she got me these matching little bowls so that it will look better when I do my cooking videos and then lastly I got us a new sheet set we've been wanting new sheets for a long time uh, we got a bunch of Bed Bath & Beyond gift cards and so that's actually where Jared's at right now buying us a new comforter set uh, but we have to order it online so I don't know when it will come in but they wouldn't let us we couldn't use a 20% off coupon online or it said in-store only so he went to the store to try to get the discount and he said they took it but yeah I got us some gray sheets I got these at Costco they were a hundred dollars on sale but I went up to Costco like three times during December and I kept passing by them and filling them and they were really soft and then I still needed some ideas for what to get Jared for Christmas so I went ahead and caved in and bought us a nice pair of sheets so I hope that they're worth a hundred dollars but we've never bought nice expensive sheets before so yeah this is a gray color and then we're getting like a blue comforter set because I wanted to change it up in our room and I was tired of the browns and blacks it came with the fitted sheet the top sheet and then two pillowcases and the brand is Jennifer Adams I tried to look up some reviews couldn't really find a whole lot but I did read a few good reviews so this will be our first night to sleep in them I just put them on but let me know if you guys have heard of this brand or if you have it but we got us a new sheet set so there is most of our Christmas presents I hope we didn't miss anything big and uh, let me know what you guys got for Christmas I thought I'd show one more thing or my favorite gift that we got the kids I know this is about us not the kids but if you guys haven't heard the troll CD it's so Good, especially if you like Justin Timberlake I already liked him but now I love him even more and me and Jojo we have some serious and Jordan we have some serious dance parties in their room to this not just like one or two of the songs but I'm talking about the whole CD we jam out to and sing and dance and it's so good so yeah like I said let me know what you guys got for Christmas and thank you for watching thumbs up if you enjoyed this I'll see you on the next video